Okay, what's up guys? In this video, I am going to show you how to define section in ETAP. Okay, to define section in ETAP, you can go to define toolbar, click on define. We click on define and go to section property. And we go to click on frame section. Okay. Okay, in here, we can see a concrete beam, a concrete column steel beam and steel column okay now I, I create section for concrete column so I click on concrete column and I click on add copy of, of property okay now you can see a uh, property name uh, the name of your column so I put it uh, C okay I put it C uh, <coughs> 30 plus 30 it's mean a uh, uh, 300 millimeter plus 300 millimeter okay and then material material I put it uh, C30 okay strength of concrete C30 and this is a color of the column you can change okay okay now it is this a uh, section dimension uh, 30 plus 30 okay 300 millimeter plus by 300 millimeter and now we go to check uh, modify show rebar. In modify and show rebar, we can see a design for column, not beam, and longitudinal bar, uh, DB390, and confinement bar, Thai bar or Thai bar, 330, uh, 390 or 2. Okay, and for column you want to design, you can click on reinforcement to be designed. And if you want to, if you want the model to check your column, you can click on uh, reinforcement to be checked, and then you can change the property here, the repair property here. Okay. Okay. It's uh, clear cover of uh, confinement bar. Okay. We put uh, forty. Okay. Then if we click on OK, and we click on OK again, we can see uh C 30 plus 30 okay now I can add one more C 30 plus 50 I, I click on it and then I click on copy of routine I put a C 30 plus 50 okay 30 plus 50 a blue color uh, material is the same C 30 a uh, deep deep and width width uh, 300 and deep uh, 500 millimeter and I put it for design I put it for reinforcement to be designed and then I click on OK and, I, and then I click on OK again okay for concrete I create one okay I, I just create two D of this and then I create a concrete beam I click on concrete beam and then I go to click on add copy of property and now I can put the name of the beam. I can put B uh, 25 plus uh, 500. Uh, B 25 plus 500. And then we can change the color. Okay, property. Property, we can put a C 30. It's mean a concrete strength. 30 megapascal. And color. You can check or, or not. Uh, section, section shape, uh, concrete rectangular. I, I don't change concrete rectangular. And for width, width 250 and deep 500. And so modify so bar. Modify so bar, you can see uh, M3 design, okay. Beam, uh, longitudinal bar, you, we can put a uh, 390 and confinement bar if you 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 use a uh, small bar round bar you you can select on this but if you put a larger bar you can select on this but uh, I already designed for the round bar so I click on this and this is the cover of top bar cover of long longitudinal bar top rib bar bottom rib bar okay I click I, I put it 60 60 okay then I click on OK and then I click on OK again now we can see 
b 250 plus 500 and and i create one more i click on it and i click on add copy of property again <coughs> i put a uh, b 200 plus 400 okay 200 400 this is uh okay the same then i click on okay then i click on okay again okay now we can see column and beam and if you want to create one, uh, more section you can create by this step okay now i go to create for steel beam okay for steel beam for steel beam i create for i copy a property i create for two so we can see uh, this is material for steel for steel we can put uh, <coughs> material for steel bar steel bar steel i can put it uh, e i to certify okay this is a material for steel and i put this uh, tube uh, 40 plus 80 plus 1.5 okay and now we can select a uh, section shape <coughs> section shape I, I select for tube steel uh, steel tube okay you can see steel tube now we can see and i change the color to blue okay total dip total dip uh, 80 total width uh, 40 and flank thickness flank thickness 1.5 and web thickness 1.5 uh corner radius corner radius is row okay so modify okay we don't change anything here click on okay and then we click on okay again okay now we can see 2 40 plus 80 plus 1.5 and i create more i add again i click i i put it a uh, 2 per 50 plus 100 plus 1.8 okay e to certify color color okay still tube again uh total dip 100 total dip 50 and 1.8 1.8 okay <coughs> okay then i click on okay and now we can see two of the uh, material here and the steel tube column is uh, the same and if you want to create mo more you can create by this step okay you can see now okay thank you for your watching and this is uh, how to create a uh, section protein in here okay thank you and see you for the next video